hi welcome back to resin by drew um i've got i've made um this extra large tray mold i've put a very thin layer of clear resin down and that's cured i've also done some coaster molds um, i'll just show you the coaster molds i've done the coaster molds as well i've done exactly the same thing with the coaster molds put a thin layer of uh, resin down and i'm going to decorate them with dried flowers um, so i'm going to start off by doing the tray first and then i'll do the coasters after that um, so i'll do similar to what i did when i did the other extra large um tray rather than just keep the video running while you watch me stick flowers down i'll um i'll keep pausing the video i'll do some flowers and then i'll keep bringing you back to show you where i'm up to if that's okay um i'm going to be using um grays gr um reds yeah and yellows i think and perhaps white as well i've also got some um, skeleton leaves that i thought might be nice to go on and i've also got some foliage that i've dried pressed and dried myself that i want to use as well um so i'm going to pause the camera while i get started and then as soon as i'm started i'll bring you back and show you um the first part of the design and um, i'll keep going um that way so i'll see you very shortly okay so i've chosen a few leaves um i might add a few more but i'll see how we go and i'm just going to start gluing them down um i'm using cosmic shimmer glue which i use for all sorts of crafts i use it for paper crafting as well it's um it really is a great glue and it dries completely clear um, so I'm just going to start gluing these down and I'm basically just going to run a very, if I can get the glue to come out, but I might need to unclog the glue. So I'm just going to run a thin line on some of the areas of the leaf. like so and then I'm just going to stick it down I put the leaves down first in the hope that I can build up a little bit of depth um, by using the leaves and then the flowers on top Okay, so I think rather than just keep you watching um, while I'm just sticking the leaves down, I'll pause the video and I'll come back shortly and show you where I'm up to um, once I've started laying the flowers or setting the flowers into a design. So I'll see you very shortly. Just thought I'd bring you back and show you where I'm up to. Um, so I'm just popping a few more flowers down.
about a pretty tiny yellow one. Okay, so I'll pause the camera again rather than you just watch me stick flowers. I'll pause the camera again and I'll come back very shortly and show you where I'm up to. So I'll see you soon. Okay, so I thought I'd just bring you back and show you um, the final results. Um, I don't think I'm going to add any more now. I'm going to wait for an hour for the glue to dry. As I say, it's good glue it dries perfectly clear. I'm go so I'm going to wait for an, an hour for the glue to dry and then I'm going to put the final um, coat on. So I'll bring you back to show you um, me putting the final coat on. But for now I'm going to switch up and I'm going to do the, um, the coasters. So I just moved this mould out of the way. bring in the coasters so I've got I want the coasters to be kind of a set really so I'm wanting them to to kind of match um, I'm not sure how I'm going to do it but let's see what we've got Just trim this one down a little bit. They don't all have to be exactly the same, but I just I do want them similar.
I'm not sure whether to stop there or to put a couple more flowers on. Um, what do you think? I don't want to overcrowd them. Um, I've got some more yellow, so let's have a look at what we've got in this one. I'm going to pause the video rather than you just watch me lay down the flowers. I'll um, I'll carry on laying them down and I'll stick them down and then I'll bring you back to show you um, the final results before I um, have to let the glue set for an hour on these as well. So I'll bring you back to show you the results before the glue sets and then um, I'll bring you back to show you the final layer. So see you in a few minutes. Hi, welcome back. So I'm going to demold this tray. Um, now, in the interest of full disclosure, um, I didn't babysit the tray for as long or as well as I should have. So when I put the second layer of resin on, I did get a heck of a lot of um, tiny air bubbles. So I had to use the Dremel, go over it all yesterday, um, get all the bubbles out and put another layer of resin on top. Um, it's quite common to get a lot of air bubbles from pressed flowers um, even though they're glued down you still get a lot of air bubbles from them as I say it was my error I didn't babysit it as well or as long as I should have done um, so but let's unmold it now and we'll have a look at it because I've had to put in effect three coats of resin on. I have got some overspill that I'll need to deal with um, just on the top but that's not a problem. Let's turn it over and have a look. Oh wow! That is beautiful and it was well worth the effort. Can you see the overspill here? That's just where I've had to put the third layer on and the um, the resin's just gone up above the the mold if i'd not had to put the third layer on that wouldn't have happened let me get some black card i think black will work best let me just check if white's better no i actually think white's better so that is beautiful i'm really happy with that just like I say I just need to deal with this overspill but that's not a problem that's easy to sort out um, it was the air bubbles um, and I did have lots and lots of air bubbles um, all over um, but the Dremel soon got rid of them and another coat of um, resin and we're good to go so yes I'm really really pleased with that tray um, I need to put the handles on so what I'll do is I'll deal with the overspill I'll pop the I'll pop the handles on and then I'll come back and show you the final result. Now let me show you the um, coaster moulds as the coasters as well. And again, it was the same with the coasters. I didn't babysit them as well or as long as I should have done. Um, so I ended up having to Dremel them all yesterday and um, go in and put another layer of resin on. But it's nothing to do with the mould, it's nothing to do with the resin, it was purely my own fault. Um, so here's the, the coasters, they're very pretty. I'm really happy with those. I think I've got, hopefully I've got just the right amount of flowers in the mould as well for, for them and I've, I've got the skeleton leaves in as well which I think is a nice touch. I think they match the um, the tray quite nicely as well. So yeah, I'm really happy with these. I hope you like them too. As I say, I'll pop the handles onto the tray and I'll take some final pictures. I'll deal with the overspill before I take the pictures, obviously, and then I'll come back and show you the final results. Um, but um, I do hope you like them. It was well worth the effort of sanding it down yesterday as well. Um, 
so yeah so i'm really pleased with that so that's it for now i'll say bye and i'll be back with another experiment soon see you soon